GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Imperial Galactic Survival. This is your host Zila, and we are here today about to start an Alpha 11 start of Invader Defender with difficulty settings. Here, I'll show you what I'm going to run with. Um, so medium on the player stuff, life stuff. And then resources, we're going to go with rich and plenty. Uh, auto miner depletion, I'm not going to use any, so I'll just leave that at true. Enemies are cranked to hardest, so hard, high, and high. And then constructors, I want fast. Blueprint fast. Uh, spawn limit, I don't care. They don't really, I don't care about spawning on a pad of concrete. It just At this point, until they implement something like the, I don't know, the, 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 the repair bay as being necessary for blueprinting or something, which is kind of a logical thing considering what the, the repair bay actually does. Um, anyway, we can get into that rant later. Uh, block limit, we're going to set that to true. You know, I, I, I'm, I'm going to limit myself to whatever the game says you shouldn't run more weapons of a certain type. Of, so we'll, we'll go with that, whatever it says. We're going to go with the the volume mass and the CPU points. <sighs> the reason I'm doing this is because they set up missions in this scenario to give you the blueprint items for, or the the uh, core items, the core extension items for the the higher tier CPU core extensions. This the the tier three and tier four core extensions require items in the game now that you can only loot or purchase. So they also added in this scenario, apparently, a bunch of missions that you can do that are repeatable that you can get these items. So we're going to try that out. Uh, I did start this once just uh, off camera to see what it was like. I didn't start try the seed. I don't know. I randomized the seed again, but whatever. Um, we're going to do the Trader Outpost. It's kind of cool. It's a moon start, so it's really resource uh, management um, kind of crazy with, with like, uh, got to deal with, like, drones right off the bat to establish yourself and then get to the Polaris. You start friendly with Polaris, which is kind of a big thing now because you got to do these, these missions and whatnot, a lot of Polaris sell those items so let's just jump right into it there's my seed that was my settings and here we go uh, it shouldn't take too long to generate the there it goes <laughs> generate the galaxy it's a randomly generated galaxy I believe or no you know what may no it probably isn't uh, I think it has random elements to it but uh, uh, most of the planets are pre-named I believe. Okay, so it starts us in a trader facility. And whoa, what is that? Something red on our screen right away. So here we go. Uh, welcome to Invader Defender 2. Uh, we're doing this trader scenario. And so grab your equipment and the trade tasks. Uh, we have enemies. Enemies so greed and envy and hate. Okay, so it's an old mercenary or it's an old output outpost that was secured by mercenaries and we're supposed to follow the PDA tutorial and flood the economy with our offers okay sure oh well look at that we're we're in space we have a suit let's see what it starts us with okay a, a bunch of stuff right off the bat uh, oh right, wow a multi boost an epic pistol <laughs> with some with a bunch of rounds some food and a little bit of fuel night vision so a couple of boosts too that's cool a little bit of money um okay so now what are we supposed to do we're supposed to grab our gear right okay so there's teleporter not active um oh there's stairs down there uh not active so none of these are active then okay so I guess we got to go downstairs. Well, I can see silicone and copper. Oh, it looks like 
It looks like Polaris right there. Look at that. Yeah, that's definitely that's definitely Polaris, right? Oh yeah. Oh crap, we're in Polaris. Oh. Scary. So there's a cannon drone, right? Already, so they're already guard. They're out guarding the uh, deposits. Okay, fun. Uh, we got an epic pistol. We could probably deal with them. Okay, so here we go. Whoa. Okay, can we? Nope. We're gonna screw our reputation if we grab that. So be careful. We can. Nope. Other faction. We can open this though. Yeah, nothing's in it. We don't need to repair anything. It's brand new. So we've got... Okay, we can get into here. Well, we're pretty much taking the whole thing, aren't we? Yeah. Uh, so no constructor. Ooh, interesting. Uh, we start with no oxygen. One water. Okay. No constructor. No oxygen. Um, biofuel. A little bit of biofuel. Holy crap. And one one fuel pack? How are we going to make... Uh, it didn't give us any... Okay, I'm not really... I don't understand what we're supposed to do. Oh, and then we're supposed to teleport. Uh, ensure you have all the gear and... Equipped armor and boosters. Okay, so we can't get into that. Well, what a tease. Give us all these things that we're not allowed to loot unless we screw up action. I think you'd be really screwed if you uh, opened those too. Because if you started screwed with, with the Polaris in this, I don't think you could actually do it. Because you got to be able to trade with them right away to get fiber, from what I remember. Um, I mean, I only spent a little bit of time at the beginning of this scenario solo, and I think we're ready to go. Let's equip our stuff. Uh, so we'll grab our gun, and okay, I guess that's it. Well, there's got to be guys somewhere. I hear them, right? So I guess if we teleport, it's going to teleport us to another section, and we can... Load the gun. Okay. Okay, so let's prep. Uh, what else Do, should we have just in case we get attacked? Let's get this down here. As an emergency purpose. Okay, so we have no constructor. We have no oxygen generator. We have a little bit of fuel. Um, well... Okay, well, let's see where this goes. We might have to fight right away or something. I forget. <laughs> uh, blind teleport. I hate blind teleports. Uh, where are you? Oh. Okay, buddy, I won't shoot you in the face. So he's Trader Bob. We'll talk to Trader Bob. And, well, we could buy stuff from him. Huh. Why didn't that trigger? Aren't we supposed to do something? Activate tutorial. Oh, crap. I didn't hit the let's go, did I? Open the personal container. Okay, so I can't get back there now, though. Uh, did I derp myself? You know what? It's okay. You can you can do this if you screwed up. and go like this. I opened it. Yay. I did open it. I got my stuff already. So... Now we, oh, that's, that's right. It gives you a laser rifle with, with, if you do that. And then you talk to this guy. Okay, there we go. So I derped out and didn't accept the quest at the beginning, obviously. <laughs> uh, do we need to buy more rounds from him? <sighs> we can buy 20, 40 rounds. We have two. You know what? I have a feeling I need that cash for something else right now. Let's just. We've got this rifle here with 300 rounds. Wow. Let's load that up. We're going to need that. Okay. So. What are we supposed to do now? 
that was it. We're done. We got our laser rifle. Go, go away. Okay. Okay. And yeah, nice. <laughs> okay. So I'm glad I put those on first. Um, oh, well, oh, oh, <laughs> oh, you bastard. <laughs> uh, and it's, oh, it's freezing out. Are you kidding me? Okay, we got a, we got a boogie then. Okay, so get that turned on. And I got no heat or cooler. I don't remember freezing last time. And time this. Ooh, yeah, we didn't die. Okay, I guess I got to run over to the, we'll uh, smash stuff on the way. Oh, you know what? I, do I even have one? No, I got to build one really quick. Let's do that. And we can, um, we can make an energy bearer if we need one. Okay. 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 So we're going to get cold really quick, but I need, I want to grab these rocks. So I should have made that tool first. Get freaking locked out. What an ass. Thanks a lot, Bob. Okay. Uh, is that done? Thank you. Let's get that in here. And we got a laser pistol too. I, I didn't see any rounds for it though, no. Um, we'll probably be able to sell it. Okay, I, I guess our goal is to get there without dying, right? So, um, was that south? That was south. And then there was a, there was a dude protecting the copper, wasn't it? Yeah, let's not go that way then. Uh, we still got iron here. Oh, we're getting cold. We're going to get cold. Do we have any way of dealing with that? I'm not sure if we do. Let's just boogie. There's silicone right here, though. I, I'm going to need it. I'm going to need the silicone. I don't know how we're going to get the copper. I think we're going to get cold too quickly. Okay, that should be enough to build whatever we need. Let's just keep going. Oh, there was silicone right there. And promethium. Okay, we're going to get cold. Come on. Come on, I need to find copper. Other than that uh, patch back there. And it might be because we're, it's like at the middle of the night too. Do you notice what time it is? It's like a really bad time of the day for us to start. Okay, let's see if we can get into this facility here before we start getting cold. And we'll just warm up. Maybe they have something we can loot. There are buddies, so yeah, there we go. See? And oxygen. Nice. Okay. So I guess that was how we're supposed to just run to here to warm up during the day. Um, oh, yeah, we can sleep until the morning and stuff. Uh, unfriendly if we open their fridge. Really. Thanks. And can't open his cupboards either. Hmm. Maybe there isn't anything we can grab. Let's just take a quick look. I'm, I have a feeling there's nothing here for us. Yeah. We can just force the sunlight. And I think I, I'm going to have to do that. I'm going to have to do that. Yeah, look at that. So unfriendly, unfriendly, unfriendly. Unfriendly, unfriendly, unfriendly. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So I think what I'm going to do is we're going to sleep for the night because it's too dark for us to run around and get stuff or it's too, too cold. So I think if we sleep for the night, Right, because we're we're playing the single player, so it doesn't matter. Oh, meteorite incoming! Meteorite incoming! Oh, right, yes, the uh, um, neodymium falls. <laughs> sets random meteorites on this on this moon. That's kind of cool. And it's got cobalt and everything else. It's got all the basics plus cobalt plus neodymium. <laughs> 
Okay. Uh, okay, so look at it. It's only minus 5 out now. So we got to get uh, copper, right? Um, so that's over there. So we're going to need to go get copper. And what's this gas refinery? So let's let's head over to there. Let's head over to the copper because we're gonna uh, we're gonna need to. We're gonna need to kill the drone though. I bet so. Let's just uh, grab these stones on the way. See, there's there's iron here so the we don't necessarily have to go get the iron from the deposit if we can deal with uh, all the stones plus I'd rather do the stones because they're worth experience and I think on this planet that's going to be a big problem starting big problem because how do you get XP there's no critters there's no trees no plants. There's just rocks. And oxygen will become a problem eventually, so I'll have to run back to the... Uh, we will have to run back. See, I don't even have a motorbike. Okay, I thought this was the one with the drone. Yes, it is. He's just off to the side here. Okay, so... We're just going to have to go for it. Let's go after the drone. We might be able to get some cover. Um, once he spots us, where is he? He's over there. Let's try and get behind some of these rocks here. Good. He's too far. He'll come. Come on. Come on. I'm going to waste all my shots. Here, let's reload. I'll just back off a bit. <laughs> oh, there we go. Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah. Okay. My God, they start you with a laser rifle. <laughs> you screwed. Okay, uh, my oxygen is depleting too, but I, I want to really loot this guy badly because I think this is going to be critical. Oh, yeah, I see fuel and power coil. I don't know how necessary the power coil is, but it might be the only way of getting uh, restroom Zascosium at this point to start. Just want to get this copper really quick. Just enough. We need to make... Um, a oxygen thingy, right? <laughs> Although I didn't really get much silicone, it's just I just needed enough to get the bare necessities. Wow, this is like way in there. Come on. Oxygen will become a thing here. So on the on the super difficult settings for the oxygen depletion, this might be a little difficult, especially uh, considering that you start with like no even bottles. They don't even give you any. <laughs> Although they do give you fuel, which, um, and you only have to hit level two to actually make the um, survival constructor now. So, eh. I mean, I did get some water, though. I can convert to small bottles. Okay, I don't think I want to take too much more, do I? 45. Yeah, I'm up to 400. Okay. And then once we make a 
Plus, I'm not getting any XP for that. Like, what level are we right now? We're level three. Okay. Well, right, because I shot the uh, drone. Okay, so we got to head back to where the... Um, that was all the way south, right? So that's all south. Nope. We're heading... We're heading east. Trader facility. We're heading east by the look of it. Okay. Let's keep going. I'll try and poach some of this Prometheum on the way. Um, we've got lots of rocks now. We're starting to run into uh, space issues. I think I'll be a little bit more selective on what I'm picking up. Uh, and another thing too is the fiber. There's no fiber. This is a this is a fiber management um, at its best when there is none. <laughs> Let me tell you, this should be interesting. We're going to have to uh, um, be wheeler dealers on the market for a bit to kind of uh, get stuff together for fiber. Okay, so we've got Prometheum here. Is that silicone? No, but we've got we've got enough silicone on us to get started. Oh, we're getting ratted from it. Oh yeah, look at that. Okay, well then, if we're gonna take radiation, we'll jump out and use our drone. We probably should have been using the drone anyway because it actually consumes less oxygen, I think. Because you're not physically exerting yourself as much. Don't quote me on that. We don't need much of this. We're just going to take some. Right? We're just trying to uh, just get started here. And that's going to be just plenty. That'll be just plenty. There's no um, magic formula on how much you need of each resource. It's just... Oh, and there's another drone coming. So let's deal with him I guess that'll be a good way to get uh, XP oh pentaxid and more silicone okay good okay where are you buddy you gotta come at me bro come at me bro No, don't keep flying away. Come back. Uh, he's, he's getting too far. I'm 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 run I'm gonna run into oxygen issues if I chase him down. Let's just keep going. And we'll try and tank off one of these buildings here. A lot of times they'll have like a courtesy um, O2 station that's not locked. So we're going to look for that. Oh, and it's getting cold. Great. Refinery. See, I see other buildings over there. Oop, don't want to break my leg. Oh, 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 oh. See, this is like a residential area. Yeah, 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 yeah. This, this should be good. Oh, whoa, whoa, buddy. Buddy's come back. Okay, so we got to be careful of that drone. Okay, good to know. So it's cooking out. Oh, didn't notice that. <laughs> um, now this is probably going to be non-lootable everything, right? And I really, I'm going to have to kill this drone. He's like right beside us here. Yeah. And, oh, we can actually loot that. Okay, where are you, drone? Where are you, drone? Whoa. Get him, get him, get him. Yeah. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Pop goes the weasel. We'll 
grab him, and then we'll go see if we can tank somewhere. And that'll be a basically the uh, <laughs> the episode, I think. Um, if we can find somewhere to tank, that's going to be huge. And it looked like we were going to be able to loot those cargo boxes too. That was uh, that was kind of um, see. Nope, not that one. Not that one. Okay. So is it just the cargo? Yeah. Okay. Uh, so I think what we'll do is... Oh, I see a, I see an O2 thing. Hey, buddy. How's it going? Um, yeah. Nice. <laughs> and we're getting hot. So let's go hang out somewhere. Uh, noodle Orbit. Sounds good. Noodle Orbit it is. There we go. And here we go. We're nice and safe. Oxygenated. We're not getting cooked anymore. Um, this is probably... Let's look into see if we can make our equipment here. What we're going to need to do is unlock the portable constructor. The heater cooler, obviously. Oh, but should we... We get the water condenser anyway. Okay, so yeah, heater cooler, and then you know what? We're gonna need, we're gonna need a way to earn some money. I think here. Um, let's just go with the shotgun for now, because I don't think it requires any carbon substrate. And that reminds me, isn't there a trader? Ah, uh, where was that guy? There's a trader that sells, like, parts and stuff in this. Um, over there, by the constructors. Yes, that's where, that's where. Over here. Right over here. Yes. Hardware. And this guy here. Yeah, there we go. Uh, motors. And nanotubes. Um, he'll purchase computers for big money. So we'll make some computers when we can. Okay. So in the meantime, let's make our gear. So we're going to need an O2 condenser. We're going to need the portable constructor. Um... And yeah, we can just kind of live, we can hang out here, and I believe we can put down our constructor too without it screwing anything up. Okay, so so this is how we're going to have to do it. We're going to have to like play the market, um, and there's there's still looks like there's more stuff to the east, wasn't it? We'll see, we'll see. We'll see. I'm hoping we can find like another residential or a different one with different vendors because I mean there's just the medical is there a medical guy in here too? No. And yeah, we can't even loot this crap. We can use the first aid station though. Well that's good. That means we'll be able to spawn here if we die. That's huge. Okay. And nice. So uh, let's hang out here at Noodle Orbit. I think, um, or you know what? No, we're gonna be we're gonna be crafting over here, right? So let's um, put our gear here. So we've got this. So I'm gonna show you a little a little trick right now with the O2. Um, oh yeah, it'll let us put it down. Good. I don't know how good of a quality it's going to be on a moon, but I uh, don't know yet. We'll have to put energy in. Now, I'm going to split this in two. The reason is, is, is these things were bugged before. Same with the other larger uh, water constructor or water generators. Um, so if you double click, if you shift left click your stack of fuel, if it's two packs, It'll go and not consume them, and you can take them out right away again. And then you get like a free pack's worth of fuel. <laughs> okay, so that's uh, now lit up where we're, we're generating oxygen. 
at 18%. That's not so bad. I've seen it worse. Um, we should probably make another or a few of those, I would imagine. Uh, getting fuel isn't going to be so bad because we've got the Promethium now. And what else? We've got uh, the Portable Constructor is built. So let's get that down. And we're also going to make the heater cooler. Um, and we still got lots of mats. I think we should make another O2 water. And then we should still have enough mats to probably make a motorcycle to go get more mats. Nice. Okay, so let's lay this down. And then... So as soon as that's done... So we can put the other crap in there for now. Okay, good. And now that we can tank O2 off these guys too, it's, that's, uh, that's going to be huge. Just want to put all the stuff in here that I don't need necessarily. Oh, that guy bought energy matrixes, wasn't he? Yeah. Okay. Maybe we might be able to sell this stuff. I'll go take a look, but I don't think so. We can turn that into O2. Okay. Was he going to buy energy? Ma I mean, there's cobalt around, so that, you know, I'm not. Yeah, yeah, Me yeah, tons of, tons of cobalt. So we can just, we can like spend energy matrix. Like, oh yeah, he does for good money too. Let's, let's sell all three. Yeah. Uh, over doubled our cash already. And then, so because of that, I think we should buy all these motors and nanotubes. So we got four. Buy as many of these as we can. Um, I guess we can make a bunch more of this stuff and sell it to him. He was going to buy computers, yes. Yeah, so we'll buy, we'll make some computers, but I, I don't have a lot of parts right now or resources. So I think what we're going to do is these are built now. Good. Put that on our bar here, and we'll just put that down right now. Get it generating water and O2 for us too with the split that in two so it's two of them and do the same trick with that and we now have double the amount of O2 generating. Okay, well, um, we have money now too, don't we? A little bit? None? Did we spend it all? We still got the money card. Okay, so we can go buy food too. So let's go do that. And we'll uh, we'll find somewhere to sleep tonight. <laughs> um, it's gonna. Well, I guess we don't need to. It's four hours yet. That's fine. Uh, grilled steak. Yeah, let's buy that. It's credits. Buy that. We'll just eat that right now. Perfect. Well, I would say we're off to a decent enough start. We're not dying. Definitely not. Um, and we're able to get like funky stuff. And I think next episode I'm going to loot all these, loot everything we can, and we'll explore some more and try and get, uh, um, I guess, a motorcycle going and see if we can get some fiber because I'm pretty darn sure I'm not going to be allowed to pick this stuff without them attacking me. So, I'm, yeah, see, I can't do it. Yeah, But we'll just take a little hint. Oh, a little sneak previews. Oh, yeah, see, there's electronics in there. But we need fiber, so, okay. And they've got a bunch of, see, there's cargo uh, houses and stuff. So maybe the cargo is all open in the spot. Well, guys, I'm going to leave it here. Till next episode, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.